Hi everybody, so today you uh, 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 got presentations about conformal predictors. They are very nice properties in terms of applications, but now I will give you some ideas in terms of uh, whether they are efficient or not. So let's, uh, and I will give you this uh, these ideas uh, on uh, based of model for uh, uh, linear regression. So we have a linear regression, it's a Bayesian linear regression and uh, every, everybody knows that if we have a prior uh, Bayesian assumption on the vector of parameters then uh, uh, Bayesian, uh, Bayesian confidence interval uh, could be uh, uh, looks like as, uh, look like as follows. Okay? And uh, what is con a conformal prediction for this particular case? So, uh, first of all, conformity measure is uh, the measure which for the given sample provides us conformity scores. Each conformity score uh, could be calculated as uh, the score which uh, gives us a degree to which the element, particular element of the sample conforms to the full sequence of the data set we have or not. And uh, we uh, define conformal, uh, uh, conformal confidence interval as follows. Uh, we have, uh, let's uh, assume that we have n minus 1 data points. So uh, for a, uh, so for a uh, some new test object, uh, we assume that we have uh, some uh, target value y. And we don't know this target value y. But nevertheless, let us assume that we, we know this y. Then uh, using this uh, n minus 1 uh, sample of points plus additional point, we can calculate conformity scores. Of course, these conformity scores will depend on this unknown y. And then uh, we can uh, calculate the proportion of conformity scores such that uh, the number of... Uh, uh, conform uh, the, the value of conformity score uh, for this uh, last element is bigger than uh, all other conformity scores. And uh, we select those uh, target values y uh, which uh, is bigger than the given confiden uh, confidence uh, probability value epsilon. And uh, 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 all the all such values of y uh, in fact defines uh, our confidence interval. Uh, so it's a non-parametric confidence interval. The, it depends only on conformity measure, and it is well known that this conf uh, conformity. Uh, con uh, This uh, prediction interval is valid in the sense that it provides the given probability of uh, coverage. But uh, whether it is efficient, let us as uh, and uh, we assume efficiency in the sense that if uh, our model is true, then this conformal prediction interval should be close to the optimal uh, Bayesian uh, prediction interval. And in fact, it. Uh, it uh, turns out that uh, if the sample size is big, then uh, it's really the case. So you can see here the asymptotics. So Bayesian in confidence interval is very close to conformal conf uh, prediction interval. And this is the main result. So details are on the poster. Thank you. Thank you very much.